want to say about this is I think it's so important and this is really hard, but it's so important to let our kids know that we struggle to, mm -hmm. to show our kids our humanness. Because the reality is, is that we do. Parenting is hard and we do fall short. And it's okay. It's okay to fall short. But again, we can't stay there. And we need to repent to our kids. Um, yeah, actually, you, you were gone, but there was an example of this earlier today. I came home from work, you weren't feeling well, and uh, you ran to do some errands, and uh, like the kitchen was messy, and the kids were just lounging on the couch, watching some kids show on Can anybody TV. <laughs> and I'm, I can't operate in messiness, so my immediately go into, we need to get moving, let's go, we need to clean mode. And there were a couple of times where I kind of snapped at them yeah. for, just because I was frustrated. And <clears throat> when we were all done, I said to them, I was like, guys, I'm I'm not perfect. I'm sorry that I snapped at you. Um, but I want you to understand, I'm not in a bad mood. And I'm just, I was irritated. And here's why I was irritated. It wasn't like I had a bad day leading up to that or anything, but I came home and this these are the things. I've been working all day and I don't want to have to come home and clean up your mess too. Right. So I had that conversation with them and explained to them why so that they hopefully maybe a little bit will catch on. And um, if one, see that I'm not perfect, I made a mistake, I can apologize. They can apologize when they make mistakes, but also maybe they'll start to see, you know, like, hey, maybe I do need to pick this up or put this here, not throw my coat on the floor, yeah. whatever it may be. Um, but it was important for me to have that conversation with them rather than just letting it go and not bringing it up, which was, could have, would have been the easy thing to do or just been move on from that. Right. I think that's such a good example. And it goes right along with what I wrote over here I, because I said the same thing. I said one of the best ways I have learned to show my humanness is to apologize because I also I I am human. I have a temper. There are times that I yell and that's probably my biggest struggle as a mom, just like a short fuse and I'm sure some of you can relate, maybe not, no. <laughs> but when I when we do fall short and we cave into that sin and we lose our cool, we need to repent to our kids. And you said that perfectly, Corey, so I won't elaborate too far on that. But this teaches them that grown-ups are imperfect and that's good because we don't want our kids growing up thinking that when they're grown-ups that they have to have it all figured mm -hmm. out and they have to have it all together. And if they haven't, then they failed.